Hey guys, how you doing? I am Shitanshu from Dream Abroad and as I told you in this video that just a couple of days ago, Canada has conducted the express entry draw number 155th. It is a big reason to smile. Why? Because Canada has conducted the all program draw once again after four months. Not just CEC or PNP applicants, but all the people who belong to different countries like India, Pakistan, UAE would now be invited. We just hope that this new trend continues once again and in the upcoming draws, they continue to conduct the all program draws. Now, many of you were actually asking that what would be the cutoff score in the next upcoming draws. The cutoff score in this draw was 478, but you were concerned that uh, will it drop to 470 or 460 in the upcoming draws? Will it go high? Will it go down? It is very difficult to predict it at this point of time, but yes, we can do certain analysis and understand the trend. So I have prepared one sheet through which we can actually get to understand about it. This is the sheet that I've prepared. Uh, it might seem a bit complicated, but if I explain it to you, it might become pretty easy. So this is the CRS score range and the number of candidates uh, as of June 8th. This is uh, the score range ranging from 601 to 1200, 501 to 600, 491 to 500. It is actually mentioned in the Government of Canada's website. They generally update these details for two days before the draw date. So if the draw date was on 8th of July, in that case, they have mentioned it for 6th of July. So similarly, I have maintained this sheet here through which we'll try to do some analysis. I just hope that it will make some sense. Okay, so here the number of candidates as of 8th June was uh, this in all the different CRS score ranges. Then uh, Express Entry Draw 151 and 152 happened where the PNP, uh, the cutoff score was for 743 and for CEC it was 437. Now, obviously when it is 743 in that case, they would have gone from this CRS range. All of these candidates got the ITA apart from that. Certain other candidates also joined the express entry pool. So 33 of the candidates joined the um, express entry pool and got the ITA. Similarly, in the other draw as well, um, you know, 392 people got the ITA and for CEC, 3508 people got the ITA. Now, because the number for CEC, the CRS cutoff score was 437 here, so there would have uh, been people from all these CRS score ranges. We cannot determine it uh, looking at any of this CRS range that there would be this number of people from this particular CRS range. Similarly here, 431 was the cutoff score. So 3,508 people would belong to any of these CRS ranges. It is very difficult or almost impossible for us to determine it. Now the picture changes from here. This is the number of candidates as of July 6th, which is also mentioned here. Now in the express entry draw 155th, the cutoff score was 478 and the number of invitations was 3900. It was conducted on July 8th, which means that out of these people, 3900 people got the ITA. Now just like here, many people would have been added on the last two days on July 7th and July 8th. But whosoever was added in these four ranges would have got the ITA because the cutoff score was 478. Now, if we do the total of all of this, it would come up to be uh, 3095. And let's say three, 400 more people got added in the express entry pool for these ranges. In that case, uh, around four to 500 people would be there from this CRS score range, 471 to 480. Now this is the main CRS score range because the cutoff score actually lies here. Now looking at the trends, it is the closest assumption that four to 500 people would belong to this uh, CRS score range. And those candidates would have scores of 478, 479 and 480 respectively. Okay, now out of those four, five, six, one and many who were added in the last two days, Four to 500 people got the ITA, which means more than 4,000 people would still be in that range 471 to 480. Now, let's say that before the new draw, which I hope that would be conducted on July 22nd and the number of invitations would be 3,900 and that would also be an all program draw. 
if we hope that uh, there would be roughly around 1500 plus minus uh, of uh, 100 people who get added to, to all these score ranges and around 700 which get added to this score range. In that case, now there would be around 4,700 people. Now the new cutoff score would also be in the same range. All of these 1,500 would get the ITA and then the rest would be taken from this score range of 471 to 480. Around 2,400 people would get the ITA if the calculations are correct. Uh, that is from this score range. Now still there would be around 2,300 people left. Again, the in the new profiles get added, there would be around let's say 700. I've kept the calculations very similar. And again in the next draw, 157th, if more people uh, get the invite, then this trend would continue. Now here, it is important to say that the profiles will be picked from this score range, 461 to 470, in which 469, 468 all comes. After all of these people in, the, in this score range, gets the invitation so once all these people get the invitation and still there is this bandwidth left then that CRS score would come down to this score range which at least by the calculations does not seem to happen in the next two draws so all in all those people who are lying in that score range of 470 to 480 you can really be hopeful that in the upcoming draws you could get the idea anytime but looking at these trends it is very difficult to uh, suggest that the cutoff score would go down below 470 in the next two draws. Looking at this, it is not possible that the cutoff score would go down below 470 in the next two draws. But yes, the third draw, the 158 draw, it seems that the cutoff score would go around 470. So this was all the analysis. In a nutshell, if we try to analyze the cutoff score, then we would realize that uh, there would definitely be a drop in the cutoff score in the upcoming draws, maybe two or three points in each draw, but it would not drop to 470 in the next two draws. That is just the calculation, assuming that 3900 invitations are issued and next few draws are all programmed draws, then the cutoff score would not drop below 470. But yes, after that, the cutoff score might go down to 470. So that is all guys, uh, that is all the analysis that I wanted to share through this video. I just hope that it would help some of you. So that is all the analysis that I wanted to share through this video. As I told you in the beginning of the video, this is not a prediction but it is, this is just an analysis. I just hope that you would like the video. If you did, please click the thumbs up button. And if you have any feedback, please put it down in the comment section below. Thanks again.